This is the Hound Pits pub. Closed for business. Half the district marked off is dead from the plague. We're right under the Lord Regent's nose, and he don't know a thing. Of course, if anyone finds out what we're up to, the watch will break in with swords drawn. And now that you've escaped, the Lord Regent's going to be tearing the city apart. Take you up to meet Admiral Havelock and the rest of the Royalists. The Admiral's a man to be reckoned with. If anyone can help you find that missing girl, Lady Emily, and clear your name, he can. I expect they're hard at work in there. Best join them. They'll help. killed the Empress. Starting at last, Admiral. We found our man. Even after six months... We can continue this later, Lord Pendleton. The man of the hour is here. Corvo, I'm Admiral Havelock. A true servant of the Empire, like you. Until the Lord Regent purged those of us who wouldn't recognize his claim on the throne. And I'm Lord Trevor Pendleton. I represent the nobility in our little group. But we all act as equals here at the Hound Pits pub. This is a momentous occasion, Corvo. I'm going to come out with it. We've been building a coalition of loyalists, aimed at ending the Lord Regent's tyranny and restoring the throne. At risk of execution, we're committed to finding young Lady Emily and seeing her crowned as Empress. We've got big plans, but we can't do any of it without you. We need your skills, your ability in a fight. And in helping us, we're going to help you destroy the men who murdered the Empress. Sorry, you must be exhausted. We can discuss this further after you've recovered. But before you retire, you should introduce yourself to Piero. He's challenging at times, but his industrious mind buys him that right. Yes, Piero's as much an artist as a technician. He's going to be crafting the gear you'll need. Go talk to him, and then get some sleep. We can talk more when you've rested. Pleased to meet you, Master Corvo. I saw you at court in happier days, but you might not remember. I was once a close ally to the Lord Regent, Hiram Burroughs, back when he was just the spy master. He's one manipulative bastard, I can tell you that. Good to have you with us, Corvo. Nothing against the others, but... I'll be crafting your weapons and gear. All custom work. For you, I will create the tools of a master assassin. And now the tank of whale oil is running. Will you get a new tank from upstairs, please, while I hold this in place? Be careful. The oil's unstable. When it explodes, there is a terrible mess. Just get it near the receptacle. Magnetism will I could build a tank that would... Perfect. Thank you, Cole. 
here, see? The Assassin's Mask. You're a wanted man, so everyone in the city knows your face, but this mask would mean terror to them. If you just hold still, fit must be precise. There. Can you see normally? Send the lens out of alignment. There. Better now? I could create more for you. Upgrades for your gear, weapons, munitions. But our situation here is desperate. Scavenge the city for valuables, and I will resell them on the black market. That should give us the money to craft the things you need. Tell me what I can make for you. difficult soon. You should rest while you can. Sleep well. Your life has taken a turn, has it not? The Empress is dead. Her precious daughter Emily is lost somewhere in the city, and you will play a pivotal role in the days to come. For this I have chosen you, and drawn you into the void. I am the Outsider, and this is my mark. There are forces in the world and beyond the world. Great forces that men call magic. And now, these forces will serve your will. Use this newfound power, my gift to you. Come find me.
days that follow, your trials will be great, Corvo. Seek the ancient runes bearing my mark in the lonely places of your world, and at shrines raised in my name. These runes will grant you powers beyond those of other men. To help you find these runes, I give you this, the heart of a living thing, molded by my hands. With this heart, you will hear many secrets, and it will guide you toward my runes, no matter how they may be hidden. Listen to the heart now, and find another rune. This place is the end of all things. How you use what I have given you falls upon you, as it has to the others before you. And now I return you to your world, but know that I will be watching with great interest.
if you like, but he won't use it. Why? Well, let's get down to it. First off, I know that assassination is dark business. But sometimes, good men have to do bad things to make the world right. Our purpose is clear. We want to restore Her Majesty's line by finding and putting Emily Caldwin on the throne. To those ends, we'll hide, act in shadow, take them apart, piece by piece. Tonight, High Overseer Campbell dies by your hand. It won't be easy. He's protected by his overseers, an army of religious zealots. But if anyone can do it, you can. Your exploits are legendary. Campbell carries a private journal. Once you've eliminated him, get the journal, because we think it contains Emily's location. Recovering her is obviously critical, assuming she's alive. That's the gist of it. Remember our cause and strike true. We're counting on you. Another thing. Campbell is holding a former overseer by the name of Martin. He's one of us, and if you met... Find him, give him whatever help you can. He's a master strategist, and he got caught working for our cause. It'd be good to have him back here at the Howitz. Attention, citizens of Dunwall. The old port district has been added to the evacuation list. Oh. Corvo. Hello. I'm Callista. I work here for Admiral Havelock. I'm sorry to intrude on your business, but this is important. I suspect you're going to kill the High Overseer, that wretched man. There's really no reason for you to listen to me, but my uncle, Jeff Kernow, still serves as captain in the City Watch. But he's a good man, and my only family. The chatter in servant circles is that Campbell just took delivery of an exotic poison, and I think I know why. My uncle's not corruptible like the rest of them. Campbell is going to poison my uncle. Do you think you could protect him? You used to do that, right? Before you had your current profession. Before you became an assassin. Just wondering, sir, if you thought about perhaps seeing Piero before venturing into the Overseer's Nest? I'd recommend going with the best gear you can get together. Ready to go? Just give the signal. straight up Clavering Boulevard, but now it's not so easy. Half the city's dead of the plague. The other half's fighting over what's left. City Watch still holds the bigger streets, and they've set up those wall of light checkpoints. A man walks through one of those, and he ends up burned to a crisp. Everything not controlled by the City Watch is gang territory. And there are the real odd birds living on the fringes like that Granny Rags. They say she's nuts. Know which is worse. Just take your pick. If you decide to go up clavering, don't let the guards spot you.
midnight. But easy, damn it. Keep them in the boat. The canal's got enough shit in it as it is. Hey! What is it? <laughs> I think that last one was moving. What? Yeah, the little one. Not possible. I inspected them myself. Keep working. One, what will two, I do now? Three. Good. Hey. Keep them coming. I told her to keep the children inside. I told her. Please. I'm a bit shaken right now. I saw some terrible things today. I can't believe the way people act in the middle of a terrible situation like this. We were just trying to get past, Attention, and they citizens. shot Mr. Ferrister. All Seventy years of age, shot in the street. Dead counter. Unreported deaths are a punishable offense. I can't believe they just shot him. Keep them coming!
Dunwall citizens, this is a special announcement from our honorable Lord Regent. This is the Lord Regent speaking. It is with regret that I announce that my term as Lord Regent has been extended through the month of harvest and potentially beyond. In addition, in this continuing crisis, the overseers of the Abbey of the Everyman remain in service to the state and are empowered to enforce order wherever and wherever necessary. We owe our thanks to High Overseer Campbell for the generous loan of their services. They can hear anything you say. I don't give a rat's ass. I really don't. They took my uncle's business over there. Seven strictures bullshit. Don't be stupid. I've been watching how they operate. Get lost. Dead. Cold as a whaler's gaff hand. Fifty years old, at least. This guy fought for the Empress. Forget his old ass. I can't even remember the Empress. We tagged it plain. Their clavering street is out. Attention, Dunwall citizens. The following businesses have been closed and impounded That's by the state we're... due to contamination. Sparrows, Barbershop, and Surgery. We have to check you over. The Duke and Dancer Ale House. Inspection Barrett's Printing Firm. Pennyworth's Tack and Saddle Emporium. And the Smoke Street Dice Hall. I owe you, brother. I won't ask about the mask. I wouldn't want my face seen either, pulling a stunt like that. You know what? I'll return the favor. Come by Griff's shop. That's my business. 
Well, it was, at one time. But now I'm reduced to scavenging things from here and there as the city dies. If you need anything, I wouldn't mind trading for a little money. Maybe someday the plague will blow over and everything will go back to normal. But until then, it's scavenging for me. Huh? Look at some of the things I found. Good prices, I swear.
all of it. Not a nice thing. Dear? Is that you, my dear husband? Oh, my eyes aren't what they used to be. Have you seen my little birdies? Oh, the dear things must be starving without their granny. Here, birdies. Here. Oh, my, my, my. I think I have gentlemen callers again, but not the way I used to, not the nice ones. I hear them, and they're not very polite ones either. Granny Rags, Granny Rags, let us in. Ah, oh, well, they'll go away again if they know what's good for them. But what a bother. Here's the key to the front door, love. You'll see to those ruffians, won't you? I think the little birdies are sad today. Let us... Would you look at this? Mm. You don't walk into Bottle Street looking like that. That I... It costs a lot. Maybe I'll let my girlfriend wear it. Who's... Got... Oh. Come on! Let's do oh. this guy! Oh. Go down, you bitch! Oh. Help me with those ill-mannered boys. My brave man. Listen, Granny has a birthday present for you. I got it from the outsider, and now I'm giving it to you. Go on. It's upstairs. On the vanity. I think you'll cut a nice figure with it. Remember how we used to dance? Our parties were even grander than those at the Boyle Manor. Everyone wanted to come. Mm, if I was a birdie, I would do that. Yes, I would, indeed. Yes. I hope you like the little gift I got for you. It's the least I could do for turning those louts away. I can't bear these Bottle Street children. Ruffians, every last one of them, rotten apples. And that slack jaw is the worst of the lot. You know what I just thought of? You could do something else for me. Another little favor. And I'd give you another present. Another lovely rune carved from the bones of a dead whale. Do you remember my doctor, dear? Dr. Galvani? Now there was a clever man. He's got all sorts of nasty rat guts and disease in his laboratory. Wouldn't it be a shame if some of that mess found its way into the Bottle Street Gang's elixir still? That'd teach him. See to it, dear. I'll find you another present just like the first. Galvani lives on Clavering Boulevard. Or at least he used to. Those were the days. Now run off. My baby birdies are hungry. So precious. Hmm.
they're shy. You'll have to go or they won't come. Attention Dunwall citizens. The following businesses have been closed and impounded by the state due to contamination. Barrow's Barbershop and Surgery, the Duke and Dancer Ale House, Merritt's Printing Firm, Pennyworth's Tack and Saddle Emporium, and the Smoke Street Dice Hall. the door handle to Dr. Galvani's lab? Yeah. I think so. No! no. Uh. Someone help me! Oh.
a second. Psst. What a sight you are in that mask. I know who you are and what you're here to do. And I can help. Unlock me and I'll buy you a drink in a couple of days. By the void, I'll buy you a hundred drinks. I have poor circulation and I see... <sighs> Feels good to stand up straight. Thank you, Corvo. What you're here to do tonight is of the highest importance. We've got to find Emily. So kill Campbell and make it quick. Once it's done, search his body for the journal, his notorious black book, and get out of there. Campbell is meeting with a guard named Kerr now, and word from my informant is that Campbell is going to poison him. Maybe you can use that to your advantage. All right, I won't be of any help here, so I'll make my own way back to the Hound Pits pub. If I see Samuel the boatman, I'll tell him to pick you up in the backyard, behind the office of the High Oak. And their enemy's head hit the floor without you taking a scratch. I was just reading in the archive about the heretic's brand. It sounds painful. Have you ever seen the rituals? I've never seen the heretic's brand. <laughs> no, it's a rare occurrence. But I did spy the face of one so branded. A former member of our order, of course. Out on a retreat, we passed through a fishing town and saw him begging. What were his crimes? Who can say? The brand is reserved for an overseer. Or even the high overseer himself, who violates our co- So it must be cast out permanently. What the Someone get over here! Die! <laughs> Now. No. Oh. 
by which he hopes to defeat the righteous. For he waits every hour. striving can he be resisted. He is various, for there are seven gates by which he may enter a man's heart, and seventy kinds of spirits which live on and beneath the earth. And the arts tricks of black magic are without number. And he is eternal. Long ages before we are born, and will continue thus long after. I hear the watch is having trouble holding the side street. Bunch of children playing games, that's all it is. Good, good. And your niece, Callista? She'll be found. My men are searching district by district. The poor girl. Callista's a resourceful one. Probably found a safe place to hole up in all this chaos. If my overseers hear any word, I'll come straight to you. <laughs> <laughs> understand how this got so unpleasant. Oh, I agree, I agree. A whore dies and suddenly this. Will you have wine? It's a Tivian Red. Thank you. Now, to business. What would you say happened last night? To be honest, I'm not even sure. My men, your overseers, a few whores, maybe a little too much ale. One harmless prank with a runaway chicken, and ten minutes later, Trevor's Alley is a sea of blood and teeth. I almost wish I'd been there. <laughs> Take it easy there, old son. <coughs> I'm all right, Colonel. <clears throat> but down the wrong way. Now about these overseers... Who are just as guilty as my own men, if not more. But my overseers have a name to protect. I can't allow you to... Oh, oh no. This can't be happening. Who stopped us? No time, no time. Listen carefully. You must. I instruct the Lord Regent to burn the Black Book. Understand? Burn it! Black Book? What do you mean? Tell him. Burn them. Then die of 
plague, you useless incompetent! I never fight you! Guards! Guards, get in here! By the prophecies, what have you done? He's been poisoned. There was a younger of your order in here before. An initiate, perhaps, detained him. You don't give orders here. Don't be a fool. He must be running already. Get after him! I'll be filing a full report. Step your report, Colonel, and I'll have your weapons at once. Idiot! One step closer and I'll gut you. You've forgotten where you are, Captain. You've no power here. You'll regret this! Raise your alarm! Someone help me out! Charge! We'll have to fight our way out. Get him to the...
back to the Abbey or the one or the other where they train the overseers to be real crazy he just wants to know where his brothers go Steve's in. you know Eddie boy get at it when he's good job hitting the dumb way or all night yeah so he goes from room to room kids sleeping an overseer giving a lecture to the kids Couple guys Some kind of You win. Somebody in there. Watch. Yeah, someone's still around.
wouldn't put the cracks on the right side of the tray. So we sat them. Take him down! I knew you wouldn't disappoint me. Now I can stroll along the waterfront in peace. And don't think I've forgotten your little gift. Go on upstairs, dear one. That will never wash. Never, never, never. The doom, the doom of Pandesia has come to the sea. The river rushed in when the barrier broke. broke. A whole district went dark. dark. Be careful, Corvo. They call her Granny Rags. You wouldn't recognize her real name, or even the name of her family, but an emperor begged for her hand once, and rich young men fought each other for her favor. I watched her consider them all, measure their worth, and find them wanting. Then, she made a different choice. You killed High Overseer Campbell, the leader of a great cult dedicated to loathing me. Only the latest in a long line of men like himself, some who held the position better than others. I suppose I should thank you. Shop.
prowler on the loose. Someone get over here! Get it! I know you're here. Die! Huh? Assassin, help! Die! Sam, from the way I hear it, Campbell lived a pretty posh life. Maybe it's not my place to say, but men of the faith shouldn't live like barons. Are you ready to go? Okay, let's go. 